Hey guys, this is Scrapping Like a Lady. <laughs> you hit your head. And I wanted to say a couple of things before I get started. Of course, you guys know I have like some major hauls to show you guys. But um, see my eyeshadow? I put on some glittery eyeshadow. And I put on the glittery eyeshadow for two reasons. One, um, because of Corona and just not even wearing makeup, you know, I was just like, you know what, today I wanna look, I wanna look and feel good. So I put on some makeup. And the second reason was I was going through my makeup, deciding what I needed to chuck out. And um, I came across the Urban Decay Glitter Eyeshadow. Uh, they came out with it about a year ago, two years ago, I don't even remember. And when I saw it, I was like, oh my God, I have to have it. But I've never worn it. So there was two reasons why I have on glitter eyeshadow today. And it's beautiful out. I don't even know what the temperature is right now in, in Texas, but it is beautiful. So much so that I went and bought some huge pots um, because I'm going to be designing my backyard um, this spring and summer. So I went and bought some huge pots and I wore this sleeveless so you know it's warm up in here. So that's what, all I have to say about why I have on eye makeup. And if you are feeling glum and down because of coronavirus, I suggest you put on some makeup. Just make yourself feel better. Do whatever you can to make yourself feel better. That's what I did in December for Christmas and that's what I'm going to continue to do. A lot of people are saying, oh, I'm not going to wear any makeup and yada, yada, yada. And why? We got to wear these stupid masks. And I'm like, well, can't we look good from here up? <laughs> Anyways, that's all I got to say regarding my makeup. Again, I said that twice. Let me show you guys what I have. All right. So let's get into my diamond art. I am doing this, what is it called? Uh, Symbols of Hero heroism and I don't know if anybody else out there do this I don't know if it's my ADD ADHD or autism Asperger's whatever you want to call it but I'm on a spectrum somewhere I know um, I don't do my diamond dots in any order from top to bottom or bottom to top I just pick a color and I <laughs> I do it like I'm doing a, a crossword puzzle. I just find my colors, you know, and I try to do the one that has the most saturated colors, like um, these reds right here. I did do all of those, and it's a variation of a, probably about three, yeah, three or four different types of reds, if you can see that. I'll bring it up there for you can see. You see? So... I really like the way this one is coming out. Again, I'm gonna frame this one and take it to um, the fire station, the little lounge fire station. I said that every one that I, um, every diamond art painting that I buy, I'm going to have a reason for buying it. It's gonna mean something to me. So these, this part is not done yet. I still have this to do and this in here and a couple of small areas to do. And then I have, what do we call this, confetti down here. So all of this variations of colors and everything like that will go down there. Um, but I think it is coming out beautiful. I love it. Um, I probably will be done. This has been seven days that I've been working on this. And I just stay up late at night and get my my stuff in. I stayed up to like four or five o'clock in the morning last night. I'm just, I'm an insomniac and it gives me something to do. So it's peaceful and wonderful and I love it. So I should be finished with this one this week and I will show you guys it when I'm done. Uh, these are my favorite candy. Does anybody else eat these? These, I, I was introduced to these when I used to live in New York as a child, violets. So I buy these by the little cases right here okay so let me show you guys this my husband came to me um the day before yesterday i don't know when was that saturday and um my husband is down here so i'm not talking to myself and he was like hey cricket is having a sale um these other people on amazon have um, vinyls do you want me to get you some and I was like yeah I looked at them and I was like yeah and the rating was actually really good on it, it was like four point four point four and a half stars right well 
on the scoring for this paper. So it had high ratings and mm, and then when I got them, I was very impressed. So it's a variations, a variety of color. I'm thinking this is transfer paper. Let me see. Yeah, this must just be transfer papers right here. But look at this. Even this, oh, I don't know if you guys can see that. It's mirror, but it's rose gold. It's beautiful. So I did get all of those. You got 40 sheets for like 20 bucks. Um, yeah. So that was good. Now, I'm going to keep this one out because I want to show you guys some stuff that I got from AliExpress. I got these dies and these stamps, and I am going to collect all of these girls. Um, I have several of them upstairs. I'm downstairs in my front room again. Um, that I need to show you guys as well, but I'm like, stop making them for I can stop buying them. No, I'm gonna buy them all. Okay, so this one right here, and the die is in back of it. And these are from AliExpress. And I also kept the this right here. And this is the um, seller. Let me show you guys this. Look at this one. That's cute too. She has her pajamas on. And I've got the dies with all of them. This one is really cute too. Look at that. Oh, let's pick it up the glare. She's got that big old hat on. I can't wait to stamp these out. And this is like a Christmas mermaid. Look at her eyes. And the candies in back of her, the candy canes and all of that. Oh my God, that is so cute. Oh, and look at, look at, look at. She's got little fur around her little butt. Can you see that right here? Okay. My husband's like, you women are so silly. And this one is really cute too. I hope this is, uh oh, I hit the camera. I hope you guys can see this. Okay, so I got these because I wanna start making some slimline cards. And this one has the stitches going around it, various sizes. And then this has the little peekaboo right here. And these were just a few bucks. I mean, I think like this was like five, six bucks. And then I got this one as well. I'm always throwing stuff. This one. Then I got these little tags. And this border right here. I just liked it. And then I got the manger, the little manger scene right there. And when I say I have so many stamp sets and everything to show you guys, it's just ridiculous. I'm like addicted, so I just keep buying them. And I'm gonna keep on buying them because I can. Okay, so let me show you guys this. Um, so I have Elizabeth um, Craft Designs and I ordered, I put my order through and then I went back for whatever reason and I looked at my order and I had ordered two of some things. So I called them and they were so wonderful. They, they changed it all for me and I owed them more money because I bought more stuff, but it's all good. As long as I don't get duplicates. Okay, so my information's not on there. I opened these boxes for I wouldn't be making all those noises. 
Um, I got this one right here, which is so cute. And I don't like whimsical stuff, but I was like, you know what? You have seven grandkids, six grandsons, and one granddaughter. You need to get some stuff to make some whimsical cars for those guys. So that's what I did. And then I got all of the dies to go with them. At first, when I had the scan and cut, I was like, you know what? I am not going to buy another die cut. Poof. You want the convenience, just just buy it. You can't take it with you. Okay, so I got this stamp set right here. Oh, it's so nice having a little granddaughter. That right there. And they live in Washington State, so I don't even get to fully enjoy them. But yeah, Grandma already bought her tickets. I'm gonna go see my grandbabies. And then my other grandkids live in El Paso. Uh, five grandsons with my daughter. Those are the dies. And I call my grandsons monkeys, so. <laughs> oh, gosh, I love that. I love, I have all kind of monkey dies. I love them. Um, What was I saying? My grandsons live in El Paso uh, with my daughter, so they were not able to come and spend Christmas with Grandma Ma because grandpa was like, no one's coming in here. We're not gonna infect them and they're not gonna infect us. And yeah. And I always say I have two things going on. I have diabetes and I'm black. Oh no, uh-uh, you're not killing me. I'll just stay inside and do my arts and crafts. Well, I do go to work. I own a med spa. So I do go to work. I wear my mask the entire time and then I come home. I go to the grocery store too, but that's it. That's all I've been doing. But I bought tickets to go see my, my husband bought tickets to be honest for May. And he's like, if it's still bad, we'll just push it out. But they have really good ticket prices right now. So yeah, buy yourself some tickets. That is so cute. I used to collect Cherish Teddy Bears and I, I just love bears. So I love those ones. Oh. Uh, that one's called Honey Bear, and this one's called Teddy Bear Picnic. Oh, I'm throwing them on the ground. And these are the ones that I added to my order. Faith. Hello. I am me you looking for. You like mommy singing, camera? Not to be. <laughs> uh. My 23 year old is sitting over there on the couch. Isn't that cute? Every time I see gingerbread men, it reminds me of Bible scraps. If you guys aren't subscribed to her, go. She is hilarious. Her laugh alone will make you die. So, but I love gingerbread too, but now I feel like I'm invading her territory if that doesn't sound silly, right? But I got grandbabies, so I gotta get these. And then this is so big. Look at this. They're big. Mmm, I love it. We made gingerbread houses, all four of us. And this was the first time my husband participated. And of course, he, his roof was magnificent, wasn't it? <laughs> he did a magnificent job with his roof. So um, the engineering part of him came out. He's artistic too. But um, this is what I'm going to use to do the um, scrapbook pictures so I had to get that one too so that's Elizabeth craft designs now this other one is mindless crafting I I hope you guys didn't see my address I said I was going to um, buy everyone that came out providing I like it, and I'm sure I will. I'll probably just buy them all because I love them. Oh my God, her husband is so cute and funny, just adorable little man. So again, it's Mindless Craft, and they've been on YouTube for um, a while. They used to have other um, YouTube channel doing um, kid books and sing-alongs and all of that kind of stuff. But I bought the February kit. 
and she designs her own stamps. I like this little baggie. This is the first kit I bought, but I bought several of their stamps. And this is what it looks like. I like this one right here. Again, I don't like whimsical stuff, um, but I do like these. And I'm so fun and funny and all of that kind of stuff. You would think that with my personality, I would like whimsical, but I don't. Um, then you get the uh, washi tape. And I am hell bent on doing my um, Valentine's Day cards. I'm not even in the camera. I hope you guys see this one. This kit was $39, I think it was. Little felt hearts. Oh, that is so cute. Those are really cute. Make some little um, cutouts for that. Little envelopes and cards. I think these are too small. Cameron, hand me a gift card out of that drawer right there. Um, I get gift cards and uh, for restaurants and I seldomly use them or even remember them, but I don't think a gift card can fit in this size right here. Thank you, get 15% off of your next order. Thank you. I'm gonna use that one. Yeah, these, these won't fit in. It didn't look like it would fit gift cards in there, but um, I was thinking about making those to send those to my grandkids. Ephemera. And this is what all of these look like. Let me come into camera. Into frame, into camera. Can you guys see that? I love buses. I love OVWs and things like that. Um, for a while, I was going to actually buy an old van and the camper. These are going to make cute little cards. And you know, I, I'm i not really a card maker, but I've been watching a heck of a lot of videos. Do you guys wanna see all this ephemera? Probably not. And so I look forward to using these. This is Echo, Echo Park, and I do like their stuff. So, so far her kit seems so worth it. Just the stamps alone. I love these lips. That's at my med spa. That's my theme is lips. So that's really cute. I'll be stamping those out in gold. Cause a girl gotta have her bling. Little thank you she put in there. Oh. A bunch of little dollies. Oh, I love that black. I do like that black. Black and gold. My shop is black, gold, and teal. Thank you for that. I appreciate it. Oh, wooden hearts. Echo Park 6x6 six six paper. I'm gonna come into frame here for you guys can see all of those. Double-sided paper. Those are really pretty. Oh my. Oh, those are really cute. I'm gonna let you guys see the back of this. 
it might just be me, but when people go one frame by frame showing each and every one, it's like, it kind of drives me crazy. So I assume everybody is that way, but you might not be, but this is the way I choose to do it. Take a look, see. Those are cute. I love all things Victorian, romantic. I'm a hopeless romantic, meaning that I want to be <laughs> romance, but I don't. I'm not that type of person. Okay, now this is cute. You guys have to see this for, woo, look at that. Uh-oh, these are going to be so cute. Okay, and look at this. Look at how big these are. I said I wasn't gonna show these. I'm just lying today. Oh, these are so cute. Mm, this is Bow Bunny. I'm gonna actually have to go and get more. Look at that. More of this one. I'm gonna have my husband order those. So I'm going to, well, let me show you this one last thing. So I'm going to talk a little bit off topic right here. Um, I had a patient, uh, I'm a nurse esthetician, and this patient has been with me for a long time. Even when I was with my other business partner at the hospital, um, this patient was my patient too. So it's been, I'm going to say about seven or eight years or more. Oh, I didn't put that in there. Um, that I've had this patient. Well, look at this. See how I'm so easily distracted? It's like squirrel. Okay, so that's the end of this. Um, package right here. I just want to say to Mindless Crafting, I will be buying all of you guys' um, kits. Every single one of them. I love it. You did a great job. Yeah. Okay, so back to my story. Story time. Now I'm Stitcherista. Um, so this patient came to see me and um, I knew that something was going to happen to this patient and the Holy Spirit was having me to say certain things to her um, because she was always upset about one thing or another and I just blurted out, how long do you think you're going to live? And she was like, to be a very old lady and I says, before I knew it, no, you're not. And she, anyways, so she says, stop it, you're scaring me because the Holy Spirit tells me things about people. And so when I tell them, then they know that the Lord really does talk to me. So um, after I said it, I was even a little, you know, taken back by what I had said, but I told her and I told her not to get a surgery that she was plan on doing. And anyways, long story short, she did do it and she died a couple of weeks back. And my employee called me to tell me that she had passed away and it has been stressful for me because I knew something was coming. So that happens all the time to me. So let's move on from there. Okay, so I gotta show you guys this. My number one company, I shouldn't even say this, but it is. I just love Sarah. I love Crafters Companion. I love, love, love the quality of their stuff. They're just good. The, the quality is amazing. Um, you guys know it's from the UK and 
um, when I lived over there, the quality of their food even is amazing. And I am comparing it to the United States. You know, uh, we, we have junk, our stuff, the quality of our um, food is junk. That's what I'm trying to say. Not the quality of our products um, per se, but I'm saying the quality of our food. Um, probably our products too, to be honest with you. But I love their stuff. I'm not sure if it's made in China. I'm not, I haven't even looked at their stuff um, to see exactly where it is made, but whoever's doing quality control is handling that. Okay. Oh, well, it says this all is UK, UK, UK. I don't see anything else. Uh, made in China. So their stuff is made in China too. But uh, whoever's doing the quality control is really checking this stuff to make sure the quality is there. Um, probably Sarah herself. Okay, so here. Check this out. I got this because you guys know I like to sew. And I got to show you guys my last sew project. I've been making kitchen boas. Oh, I am in love. In love. Okay. So... That's where I can make a card with all my kitchen boas that I send out. Isn't this cute, babe? Mm -hmm. Isn't it? Okay. And then this one right here, it has a bunch of um, sayings on it. Happy crafting. Um, craftiness is happiness. Creating is caring. Da, 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 da. Eat, sleep, craft, repeat. <laughs> Oh, gosh, and they're pretty good sizes. And then I got some stencils. So, um, what is it, Chris? I think it is. Craig um, on Crafter Companion. I just love his little squeaky voice. So, um, whenever he does stuff, I love to watch him. But this is a stencil made with love. And yes, remember guys, years and years and years ago, I showed you guys how to make your own stencils on your scan and cut. Well, sometimes, you know, I just like convenience. So I got this one made with love. I have a whole bunch of stencils. I'll do, I'll do, I'll do. Now, let me see this. Even the quality of their paper and containers that they put stuff in. See, that is so versatile. And I love that. That's why I like stencils. Okay, this is very... Look at this argyle. So you get three stencils in there. So you can make the different argyles. You can move the shape and make various shapes. But isn't that awesome? And then <clears throat> this one right here. You get those three. Yeah. And then this one. Oh, I really like this one. And you get these three patterns here. And of course you can use them, you know, together or not together. You do whatever you want. And then this one. That also remind me of those when, what are they called? You blow them and they twirl. That's what those remind me of. <clears throat> I don't know the name of them. I never know the name of stuff. I just remember what things look like, but I never remember their formal names. It's too many words in this world. Everything is just the thing. Remember that thing? Okay. And then these are embossing folders. How's that print? I like geometrical shapes and stuff and these are like little belly bands and things like that so I like these ones that at least that's what I was thinking um, of them yeah 
But, I mean, she has it going down this car front right here. Of course, you can do whatever you want. It's yours. But, um... Slot. I thought there were two in here, but it's only one. It says one piece. If you just read, you would have saw. Okay, okay, it's all good. It's all good. Well, this one is solid, and this one is cut out. If you look at it, you see how this one is cut out, and this one is solid. So you get one solid piece. So what's that about? I know I'm, well, I am crazy. I was going to say, I know I'm not crazy, but that would be a lie. Because that is crazy. Okay. Now, this is my first, no, my second set of paper. And I don't have any of the Garden of Love or her signature collections. So, let me get into the quality. For Christmas, I did buy my son a bunch of their different papers, you know. Um... Oh, oh, okay. But I don't have any of her um, glitter papers or any of those. Okay, I'm really liking the way this feels. You guys can't even appreciate this. It's very fine. Um, and this is, oh, whoa. Okay, that was it's two together. Look at that color. Oh, it's just going to look like gold. It's not. It's like a bronzy gold. Can you see it down here? Yeah, it looks, you can see it better. It's a bronzy gold, because when I bring it up, it looks like gold, but it's not. It's a dark um, copper gold. On. No, not, oh, very light copper, how about that? Okay, and green. Now see, this is a light yellow. If, if you compare the two, you can see. Okay, that's a light gold. And then pink. Oh, I wish it would have had some blue in this. That would have been really pretty too. Okay, those are cute. Those are cute. I'll put that back in there later. Now this says um, A4 Luxury Glitter Card. Okay. Okay, so let me show you guys something right quick. Where's that at? Okay. So Bible Scraps, yeah, I think it was Bible Scraps, said that they had this on Amazon. It's a um, double adhesive. And so look at, look at all of this paper. Yeah, I'll be dead. My grandkids will be passing it to their kids. Um, but look at, I can just stick this on there, run it through. Damn, I do have the Xyron. Um, but this was like, I think like 50 bucks, I want to say. Mm, maybe it was 40 bucks in shipping. I don't know. I think it came to like 50 something dollars, but it is worth it to me. Um, those Xyron cartridges are expensive, even though I have a hell of a lot of those too. Lord knows I do. But, um, yeah. Okay, all right, you guys don't wanna see me pack up. Just step it, put it to the side, right? Oh my gosh. Okay, is this color coming in? I don't think it is. Oh my God, it's so awesome. More glitter paper. Okay, this is mirrored, and you guys are not gonna be able to see it because the ring light is shining through it. I don't know. Maybe I thought I could like slip it by it. But yeah, I wanted some of their mirrored cardstock. And this is the pearl. And you can't, the camera's not picking it up either. Let me see if I open it up. Let's see how I just tear things open. Hot mess. Okay, let's see. 
can you guys, oh yes, you can see it a little bit. Look at that pearl. Look at that pearl. So anyways, you know in the UK their stuff is um, 4A and it's a different size paper than we have. We have what, eight by 11 and a half or something like that. And there's this different size and I don't even know what it is, but I know it's a different size. I think they'll give it to me in centimeters. No, they don't even give it to me here, but. Anyway, so this um, is 250 GSM uh, pearl card stock. It includes six sheets um, and four vibrant colors. So you get a total of 24 sheets in total. And I think all of them are the same. Yeah, 250, 24 sheets, 24 sheets, 24 sheets. Anyway, so I'm going to stop this video because it's been going on long enough and I will probably make another video tonight. This is Scrap and Like a Lady. Be blessed and I am out.